um, thought that this would really be a good time to uh, talk with the media as it relates to what's going on in the police department. I know back in October when uh, Chief Lovett uh, submitted uh, his his retirement, his letter of retirement. Um, you know, it, it was kind of unexpected. Uh, however, um, it was accepted and, and realizing that the city had to uh, move on. I'm anxious to move forward. Um, thought it was uh, important for us to clean up the things that we needed to clean up and we've turned the corner so I, I think we can move forward. We are doing what needs to be done to prepare the agency for whomever the city manager decides um, coming in as permanent chief. Uh, we want to make sure that that person do not have to deal with some of the issues that we are currently dealing with so we want to wrap that up as, as soon as possible. There is light at the end of the tunnel, but it's going to take us a minute. We still have um, some work to do. I have had a number of officers um, actually approach me about um, staying on. Um, I hear this all the time from the community, in fact. Um, but when I spoke with Ms. Cutter at the onset, I indicated to Ms. Cutter that my desire was to um, do everything that I could possibly do to assist in this process and stabilizing this agency and preparing it um, for a permanent chief coming on. Those plans for me have not changed. I am in the preliminary stages of, of moving um, the recruitment forward. Um, I will be sitting down very soon with the City of Savannah's uh, Human Resources Director um, and I will be putting that into her hands to work with the Human Resources Director uh, of Chatham County. Uh, we are going to uh, go out with the national search. Uh, a national search does not mean that um, it's guaranteed that it will be someone from the outside. Uh, what we're looking for is the best candidate and or candidates for the job.